definite need to allow citizens of this community to have access to good fruits, good vegetables, good produce, uh, and uh, unfortunately, it's not always the case. We know we have food deserts in this community. I'm just delighted to have the opportunity to experience this market today. We've heard about the HEAL program through Meg and the St. Joe Foundation, but it's different to just really be amidst it and to see the people who are benefiting from both the education, the food, the healthy activities. Mm. To see the children earning money to buy fruits and vegetables. So it's just a great experience in a project that does the poor handmaids proud. Ten years ago I had a conversation with Sue Angar and we were talking about our obesity. We were getting worse every year. How can we address this issue in our community? So my message today is HEAL is doing that. It was designed to address the food insecurity and the access barriers to healthy food. We have five farm markets. We're the only ones in town, a heel market, that will double SNAP purchases. So if you bring your SNAP card and you have $5 on your SNAP card, you'll get $10 in tokens. And these tokens can be used all summer long um, at any of our heel markets. If you are a WIC um, family, we have the WIC office. We have representatives sitting right there. They will take your WIC card and give you produce vouchers. So depending on the size of your family, you can get up to $36 in produce vouchers. We double that to 72. Tell me what you think about it. And for me, it's to teach uh, the community, the neighborhood, how to eat healthy. A lot of participants here, they uh, do not eat healthy. Like for example, I had a hard time with them with grain, whole grain. They don't like whole grain, even whole wheat bread. So I brought a sample in for them to taste it, and whole grain rice. So it's just a matter of trying to teach them how to eat healthy and that they could cook healthy and it still have a good taste to it. I had uh, gained weight and knees and stuff was bothering me and found out that I wasn't eating like I should. I have to admit that some of the foods I seen cooked didn't look good, but when I tasted them, it was totally different that it was good, using vegetables wisely, because we we're always stuck on meat, gotta have meat, but I've learned that uh, vegetables were with the protein, and some of them had protein that you could use instead of eating meat. About two, three weeks ago, I went and had a physical from my family doctor, and he gave me the go ahead, everything was good, my blood pressure and everything was normal, and I lost 30 pounds. He'll give them a good idea of what they can do if they want to eat healthy, what they can do to be healthy. And that's what the Hill class does. It gives them an idea other than what they already have.